I was just going to say to the camera that we head out this afternoon to look for snakes and we just found a leopard tortoise. I almost step on it. Yeah. <laughs> and it's oh. interesting, you can see two very big ticks on it. Uh -huh. yep. Big and ones. Here. No. We are walking in quite different habitat than in the morning because now we are not looking for soft-scaled vipers or car carpet vipers but we are looking for cobras Hello Hi Hello Hi Ciao Oh, you are scared by the camera. Sorry. Wow. It was someone's house before. But the water is already inside. And the lake is coming closer and closer. So very interesting story. It's the same like in Lake Nakuru and also other lakes around. So it's another old flooded house. You can see it's already without walls and the lake is completely inside the house. Till now, no luck with snakes, just the snake skin. I'm not sure which snake it is but at least some snakes are probably around. After coming from the field, we work a lot uh, at the, on the computer, so we need to transfer the footage, either drone, GoPro, or from the main camera to external disks. So we take the whole package of everything, what we have filmed, um, on these discs and that's what we use for working uh, on the documentaries later in Europe so and it takes quite a long time it can take like two or three hours so we are going to check the airstrip which is nearby our accommodation maybe there will be some snakes basking still getting a little bit of heat after the darkness there can be half feathers Cobras, maybe we can find some sleeping arboreal snakes. Let's see. Sand snake? Punk tortoise. Uh huh. This is my guess. What? The Samorphous punk tortoise. Samorphous punk tortoise. Okay. Dorsal stripe. Yeah. Going all the way down. Uh huh. Okay. And the head shape. Yeah. Good sign. Yeah. But they're diurnal. Yeah. The they're sleeping, sleeping now somewhere hidden. So I was lucky enough to catch a night jar, it's a bird which is active during the night and if you shine light on them you can come fairly close and even catch them, very interesting birds, just active during the night, uh -huh. slender tailed night jar. During the day, they are well camouflaged. You can see the pattern on them. When they sit down in the bush, they are almost invisible. So let's go. Mm -hmm. Walking around Lake Naivasha, it's a good place for pythons. It's late afternoon, we have like one hour to check the lake shore, so we'll see if we'll be lucky to find any. Some python was here, not sure how long time ago, but it was here. The question is which direction it was going. So we are back 
at uh, the shore of Lake Naiwasha and we are going to head to Creston Island to try to look for pythons and other snakes. So you see Susanna's already prepared to get on a boat. <laughs> I'm ready. <laughs> yeah. You know I lost my hook yesterday but we found it this morning so I'm happy now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. My hook is here. Our hook is here so again. So that's great. Yeah. 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 <laughs> so we are leaving the mainland, <laughs> going to the island looking for pythons. Yep. Python feed. Yep. Yeah. It's an amazing place to look for snakes and being walking, you know, among giraffes. That's really cool. This area around the water looks absolutely amazing I mean this is the type of environment where you would expect a python to be it's just a matter of seeing it hello little boy So we have last morning uh, here in Naiwasha and Oli's friend um, Benji rescued a black neck spitting cobra uh, a few days ago and we will film it and then release it so uh, it's a good chance to to work with the species and also having the chance to see it being released Was a proper one. Yeah, I see it now <laughs> on the visor. Uh -huh. okay. She doesn't like the GoPro.
Oh, yeah, yeah. She, she's free to go. Free to go, girl. Stay still, stay still. See what she does. Uh, 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 uh. You are free to go. Yeah. You can is. go. You can go. Yes. That's it. Go. Bye. So we will now pack our things and head to the east, just south of Tsavo National Park. And we are on our way to Tsavo. Unfortunately, we couldn't make it in one drive because in the morning we were filming the black neck spinning cobra, but it was awesome. And so we'll spend one night here it's like 160 kilometers from Voi and so we'll continue tomorrow and now we are just going to enjoy baobab trees which are totally awesome what do you think Michael about the baobab tree? it's fat <laughs> and it's good <laughs> I like it, it's, it's really good yeah, you're right it's fat and good and all of us like it. Susanna is going to check if she can find some snakes up in the baobab tree. Do you see any cobra? <laughs> no. No. Uh-huh. Do you see a baobab? Yes. So, uh, we arrived to a beautiful area south of Tsavo National Park. We are going to cook some lunch now yes some noodles and soup. i mean check this out this is one of the most beautiful views you can imagine and also this area should be perfect for snakes locals are saying that they see many of them red spitting cobras black mambas pythons and other different species so uh, we want to stay here at least two days uh, we ask people around the community to look for snakes and call us if they see any snake so we will also of course try to walk around uh, and try to find some snakes by ourselves we hope we can get some luck the main target is the red spitting cobra uh, which we really uh, would love to have in our documentary about the most venomous snakes of Africa let's see if we can get some luck put in and then you just switch it on and you operate it with your phone so you see there where it flies so it goes up it, it can turn like this so you can see even with the camera i can put it to look down so we prepared lunch we can this is the lunch so we use Al dente. <laughs> robert is enjoying Delicious. lunch also <laughs> and these young people who visited us to look for snakes Nioka. It was a dead snake on the road, so we are going to check what kind is it. It's twiggy, no? Uh, sand yeah. snake? No, it, no, I think it's twig snake. No, it's a, you see, it's a sand snake. Sand snake? It's a sand snake for the different yeah. species. Uh, it's a fresh? It's fresh. Yeah, fresh kill. Definitely from this afternoon. It yeah. wasn't here before, so yeah. 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 Ah, that's bad. Unfortunately. 
yeah many snakes die on the roads so now we are in the bush and we will be looking for red spitting cobras and other snakes which we can possibly find uh, so we'll see how it goes but it looks promising